pi. What is pi? And why do we take the pi value as 3.14159 and continue? Pi is actually the name given to the ratio of the circumference of the circle to the diameter of the circle. You can calculate it easily by taking the circumference of the circle to the ratio of the diameter. It is often written using this symbol. Now, what was the necessity for the pi? Pi has a very important role in mathematics and physics along with other sciences because the circle is a part of our life and finding the boundary without the pi value would be very difficult to measure. Have you ever thought that how can you measure the boundary of a circle? There are two possible ways. One, that you can cut the boundary of a circle in a small part possible and then put them in a straight line to measure it through a meter rule. Or the second way is that take a thread and put it around the boundary of a circle and then measure. But in these cases there is a possibility of error and it is not that easy and reliable. So ancient people started to find out the boundary of a circle in a new way. They took the circle of different radii and divided their circumference by the ratio of their diameters. And the result was surprising. They got the same value again and again. This value was known as pi. In the Babylonians time, the pi value was 3, through which they performed many things. Then later it was redefined by the Greeks and the Archimedes was the first mathematician who for the first time determined the theoretical calculation of the pi. Though we use pi in many different areas, some very common uses of pi are to find the area and the circumference of the circle.